Hey guys, have you ever heard about Geocache app? This app is very fun to do. So for this adventure, we decided to play this app, which consists of you choose a location that is already pinned on the map. You have names for each little treasure box you can find. We found one that was called In Memory of Little Michael. We were very curious to see what this box would contain if ever we would find it and where it is exactly. So we wound it up here at this location. This is where the box is supposedly buried or hidden somewhere. I didn't find it, I really looked around for it, but I was very curious to know why they called this location in memory of little Michael. So we went and checked up on Google and talked to some family members that are born and raised here in this area and they all remember this little boy named Michael that disappeared May 30th 1949 he was six years old and they found him 14 days later unfortunately he he passed away and this story made big headlines in those days and a lot of country singers made a song dedicated to him if you listen to the song you hear the story of what happened the part that I know of this story is that he was with his older brothers in the woods and it was about to have a thunderstorm coming so the older boys told little Michael go back home we'll meet you there but little Michael never made it home after I got home I researched even more deeper into this story and I found out the whole story and where they buried little Michael so the second part of this video will be the full story about little Michael and where he is buried. We will go visit him. So guys, I hope you enjoy the video and try out the app. You never know what you could find. curious I was talking about the car that slowed down to watch what I was doing filming there's a sand pit take a motocross bike in there that'd be fun no I don't think there's something here guys unless it would be like on the other side of the street check and see because when I did my Scaranoia video people said you had to get out and walk a bit <laughs> but I already knew the story <laughs> so now I'm walking just a bit to finish off the uh, geo cash app could be here no okay well one thing I know of this area right here though, on this side, I learned that when I went to school for the, the job I had at Taurus Information Center, I was the coordinator, and they said this exact spot where you see the grass, well, that used to be a cemetery for the natives of this area. The uh, 
Abenaki Indian tribe. There's like water current over there. See that? That is beautiful. So I've been told that all this green grass here used to be a burial ground. So there's another car coming. I'll put you on pose. So guys, I decided to do a necrophonic session here for the Indian tribe and maybe we can get some information about the little Michael as well. Why did the person name this uh, box in memory of little Michael? So I'm going to try and zoom you out a bit so you can see the grass and on the other side of the river there's a forest there try and get both that should be okay so I'm gonna start necrophonic and see what happens Hello? Is someone... Hello? Is someone here? My name's Sandra. What's yours? Is it true this place used to be a native burial ground? Sorry for the wind. Hello? Is it true this place used to be a native burial ground? Ovulus said jacket. Check. That's a car going by. Curse. I didn't realize the black and white filter was on. Sorry. Wait. Ghost tube said Randy. <coughs> Ovulus said Luz. <coughs> Ghost tool said Aunt. There's another car passing. Horse. Threat. Threat. Ovulus. Is someone here? Is, is Teresa here? Hello? Are there any Abeniki tribe members here? No. Carter. Who's Carter? Ours. <laughs> Did you work many hours here? Yeah. 
Can you tell us your name? Hi. Are you a man or a woman? Can you tell us where you're from? Did you used to live here? Do you know a little boy named Michael? Give him. What? What do you want me to give little Michael? Is little Michael here? Can you tell us your name, please? Yeah. Can you show us where you are standing? Are you on the side of the river? Are you on the grass? Awesome. Are you in the forest? <laughs> Did someone pass away in this river? <laughs> Can you tell us your name? <laughs> Are you from the Abeniki tribe? I Did you use to fish in this river? Does someone you know pass away drowning in this river? How many people drowned in this river? Can you tell us a word in language? How old were you when you passed away? There's a little boy spirit named Michael here. 
Why do they call this place in memory of little Michael? <laughs> Did little Michael have an accident? <laughs> Was it a car accident? How many spirits are here with us? Is that little Michael trying to talk? Let little Michael talk, please. Where are you, little Michael? Are you on the side of the river? Did you fall into the river? Tripped? You tripped and fell in the river? Are you the only spirit here? There's a car coming. Hold on. Okay. So you tripped and fell in the river? Can you show yourself to us? Was this a native speaking? Do you have any message for us? Was it in the woods? Was it where we see grass? How many spirits are here? How many female spirits here? How many male spirits here? Are there any children spirits here? Do you know my name? Is
There's little Michael here. Yeah. Hello? Did you fall into the river by accident or someone pushed you? You like to come and play on the side of the river? Did you used to fish here? Whoever's here, can you show yourself to us? Have you showed yourself to us? How long have you been here? How did you pass away? Do you remember what year you passed away? That was a little boy. Can you speak again, please? Is the little boy still here? You can come and speak to us. How old are you? You were eight years old? <laughs> what happened to you? Can you tell me, please? Because I, I have to go soon. Was this little Michael speaking to me? That said he was eight years old? And how old are the other spirits? Were you sick when you passed away? Does someone have a message? Does someone have a message for us? Little Michael, do you have a message for us? 
Mike. Why do they call this place in memory of little Michael? Well, okay. Thank you for communicating with me. You are not allowed to follow me home. You must stay here. So guys, this used to be the a burial ground for the for the Indians, natives of this area, but they call it uh, the Little Michael Point. I don't know why. There's a Little Michael that died here somehow, either by the river or by the road. We don't know exactly. I'll have to re-listen to what we recorded. There's a plane coming somewhere, somehow. Oh, it's up there. So, guys, I hope you enjoyed this video. It's really a nice, beautiful place here. Really relaxing. I hope you enjoyed the views. So on that note, that'll be it for now. So if you like this video, please give it a thumbs up. If you're new to the channel, please consider subscribing for more videos like this and put on the bell. And I'll see you on the next video.